Hello everyone, welcome back with an RSPS video and today we are back on Vulcan RSPS. A very big old school RuneScape based RuneScape private server out there. It has been released roughly a month ago, we did an announcement video, it was hella exciting. And today ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go through some of the most important features the server has to offer and why it is over 500 players online every single day. If you guys never checked out Vulcan, make sure to do so, the links are down below, you will definitely love it. It has a huge variety of contents and I would say, let's get right into the video. First things first, very, very nice home air right here. We have a little bit of gambling. We have the nice uh, banking, aka GE theme right here. We have the beautiful AFK right here, where you guys can do a bunch of different skills, as you can see right here, taking advantage of those miserable grinds, aka farming, hair blow, etc., rune crafting. All of that can be AFK League grinded right here in the beautiful AFK area. And overall, very, very neat home area. Over there, we have the teleporter shops right here. Looking very sharp. Checking out the beautiful interface right here, we can see right now, not even super peak, 497 players line right now. That is absolutely freaking mental right here, guys. We'll be able to check out a bunch of different quick actions right here. Super useful. Different interfaces that you guys will be able to check out. And most importantly, we've got the leaks interface right here. Absolute freaking amazing. There's leaks three that you guys will be able to grind on right here. So let me give you a brief explanation what this is. First things first, you got the information tab right here that will lead you to a sort of guide on the forums. Then we have the different tasks right here that you guys will be able to go ahead and grind. We got these different tiers that you guys will be able to choose from. Different type if you'd like to go for skilling, combat, questing, whatever you guys would like to go for. Different areas, skills, and also the ones that have been completed and not completed right here. While playing the game and not even focusing on leaks, you guys will be completing a lot of those because there's a shit ton of tasks right there today. For example, click on this one right here, chop some locks right here. You guys will be getting yourself some five leak points and one Sages Renome right here. Chop any kind of lock right here. Super easy. And as you can see, the list is freaking endless. The Sanjus Renown are used to unlock the beautiful skills, those bosses. As you can see right here, those are the points. And then you guys will go ahead and unlock those bad boys right here. I have 26 right now, so I'll be able to unlock it. There we go. We've just unlocked a new boss. Absolutely freaking nice. The animation top freaking notch as well right here. And as you can see, I have six left right here. So you guys will be able to go ahead and unlock all of those bad boys right here. The same goes for skilling and also the beautiful quest thing. If you guys click on fragments right here, that is where you guys will be able to spend your leak points on those different tiers right here. First things first in this interface right here, I would like to go through the passive effects right here. Spending your leak points, which you guys can find that right inside right here, you guys will be able to unlock a bunch of different passive effects right here. As you can see, all the way to tier 8 right here. Absolute freaking amazing. You guys can read through them. There is a shit ton of crazy effects you guys will passively be unlocking for your account. Then we can see the top side right here, all those different fragments, as well as those battles on the left hand side right here. Fragments will be giving you guys even more abilities, but in a much more customizable way after you unlock them and equip them. Very important to mention, you guys unlock them by doing skilling, PVMing, hitting mobs for the combat fracks, collecting resources will give you fragments right there. So you just play the game and you guys will be grinding those lovely fragments right here. You will lock fragments correlating to what skill combat style you're going to be using. Each tier, rank up, and leaks will allow you to equip another fragment. So that's a very amazing interface right here. Definitely make sure you be checking out this leaks free right here because that is bringing you a shit ton of content to grind. And then we also have those fragments right here that you guys will be able to go ahead and break, which are gonna be giving you guys some beautiful XP. And as a congratulations, you've gained XP in whatever that name was, but you guys get the tier. Those are the fragments you guys will be collecting, then you guys will be getting XP. For example, that one, Unholy Wizard, right here. Again, fragments right here, and you guys will be able to find this bad boy right here. Unholy Wizard, for example. And then you guys can see how far you've grinded this bad boy right here. And then you guys can see the effects that you guys will be unlocking at each level right here so that is freaking insane there is so much coding behind this so you guys get the day how freaking amazing the server is also I can definitely recommend column column topic 43 in game it will give you a really good starter guide for those beautiful grinds right here it's going to tell you exactly which way you guys want to go and you guys will be unlocking a bunch of beautiful xp in the leaks right here and they're going to explain you exactly what to do it is absolutely nice teleport to cog for example super easy like that and you guys will be able to get a very nice head start and a sort of guidance for your leaks grind right there. So I definitely check out column column topic 43 in game. 
To check out the teleport right here, you can click on the T if you donate it or you just go to the beautiful portal right there. You can search for NPCs, you can go through the list right here. Now, as you can see, there is so much content. It's actually crazy. A couple of custom boss I'd like to go through really quick. Next, all the crazy ones right here. As you can see, Epsil Sire, Artiru, Callisto, Kavarion. Bro, there's so much freaking content here. One of the latest one that was added, Duke, Sussilus right here. I'm not really sure if I pronounce it right. Then we have Golvik right here, Spory Boss, Got Wars, Grotesque Guardians, Alchemical Hydra, Carfight, Queen, KB Day right here, Lame Vinthin, Phantom Musma right here. Also, brand new one, absolutely freaking nice. Kraken, Next, Nightmare, Zarachnis, Scorpia, Pemukla, Smoke Devil, Spender right here, Varvoris right here as well. I'm not even sure if I pronounced that right. Vardorvis right there. Crazy freaking shit. Venonetis, Vadian. Worker, the Whisper, also new boss right here, and Zora, absolute crazy. And also, all the different maps they're using for all those bosses here is absolute freaking nuts, boys. Not gonna lie, the amount of content right here is just freaking beautiful. So, I, yeah, you guys can definitely tell. And there's another system update right here, so another update is dropping very soon. So, I, absolute freaking OP. Alrighty, boys, we're back online. The update was dropped as well. As we can see, bro, look at how many people are already online, dude. Absolute crazy. I've just unlocked those beautiful prayers right here. They were actually planned to be released in old school runescape. However, the community decided against it. Pretty fucking crazy. And as you can see, there are so many freaking prayers here with so many different effects. Absolutely freaking crazy. We can just have a look, for example, for level 75 right here, Patch. One in three of damage dealt is also removed from both yours and your opponent's prayer points. What the fuck? That is crazy. So, as you can see, a huge variety of those custom prayers. Top freaking notch once again. Back to the teleports right here. We're going to check out the beautiful rates they have. Toms of Amma Scouts, T.O.B. and Chambers of Zarek fully working. Right in Vulcan as well, which is big fucking news. Not many Amma Scouts, T.O.A. right in here. So, that is a very nice content piece you guys will be able to grind on Vulcan right here. Mini games wise, Gauntlet Inferno, Jack Challenge, Fight Caves, Nightmare Zone, Barrows, Puro Puro, Winter Taunt, Warriors Guild, Zalkana, also part of it, a bunch of lovely skilling teleports, wilderness teleports as well, as you can see right here, raining and cities as well. So endless freaking content to be grinded on Vulcan. And a small highlight right here, we can see the freaking wild got worse right here, the wild boss cave right here. So as you can see, there is new wildy boss as well available on Vulcan. So that's actually pretty Freaking insane. Also, the wilderness is very active, obviously, with the play account these guys have right here. There's also PK accounts and a bunch of lovely options to spend your PK points. Well, as you can see in this beautiful shop right here, mystery boxes and so many other nice quality of life items you guys will be able to purchase. Also, BH ornament kits are available that you guys will be able to get yourself on Vulcan. And most importantly, the amount of updates these guys are releasing, as you can see right here, shit ton of updates releasing, non freaking stop weekly updates right here, absolutely freaking crazy. 10 updates in September fast right here in one month. Absolute crazy. So these guys are putting so much work into Sava. Also, what you guys will be definitely able to check out right here is their knowledge base and guides, which are truly amazing. And just within one month, there's been over 40 guides right here. So definitely go and check them out. There is literally anything you want to know, you will be finding here. From starter guides, over the leaks, over all the unique content pieces, you guys will be finding out right here. And of course, you guys will always be able to ask in the CC. There is hundreds of players online that will be able to help you out. So do not hesitate to ask them either. And yeah, what an amazing server. Super, super excited to be checking out right here. Check it out with the links down below. And of course, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you online. Thank you so much for tuning in. Have a good one and peace out.